As part of efforts to mitigate the outbreak of monkeypox in the country, the Nigerian government has called on relevant stakeholders to intensify surveillance, especially on animals. Minister of Agriculture and Rural Development, Mohamed Abubakar, who made the call in Abuja, said, The point of entry for wildlife are under scrutiny as the disease could affect farmers and cause low agricultural production and productivity if unchecked. He said, there was need for continued collaboration with relevant sector to promptly contain the disease in the event of an outbreak. The ministry would like to assure the general public and the international community of her resolve to continue to collaborate with relevant sectors and stakeholders to promptly contain the disease in the event of an outbreak in the country. Why calling for increased hygiene? Hand washing and the use of alcohol-based sanitizer after contact with infected animals or humans. The minister said awareness is ongoing among hunting communities to tackle the disease. He further advised the public to avoid contact with animals that are sick or found dead. The main means of transmission is usually due to spill due to spillover from animals. Man-to-man -man transmission is less common. The disease clinically resembles smallpox. Some identified risk factors include hunting, illegal trade in wildlife, and handling of wildlife in wildlife market, or wet market as you may call them. Also, since the 13th of May 2022, cases of monkeypox was reported to the World Health Organization by 12 member states across the regions. Between September 2017 to date, a total of about 558 suspected cases of monkeypox have been confirmed across the country. Monkeypox was first detected in 1958 in monkeys and rodents, but now transmissible to man and other animals. Symptoms for the disease include fever, headache, measles, eggs, and exhaustion. Ugochi Obaja, CNA News.